A South Carolina teenager faces charges of assault and battery. He's accused of choking another boy and on an Orangeburg County school bus. It happened about a week ago. Alexis Simmons talked with the victim's mother about what happened. It took my son's life. That belt, if they would have pulled it tight enough, it, should, it would have killed him. Then I would have been without a child. Virginia Meyer says her son hasn't been the same since he came home with a bloody shirt after being choked on the bus. Just a warning, you might find this video graphic. <laughs> Authorities say the video shows a student choking Meyer's 19-year-old son while on the way home from school. 17-year-old Jatabius Lee was charged with third-degree assault and battery and appeared in court today. The boy came behind him. Put this belt around my son's throat and drag him on there like a freaking dog. You know, like he wasn't even human. Take it easy. Who does that? Both students attend Lake Marion High School in Holly Hill. According to the incident report provided by the Orangeburg County Sheriff's Office, the victim stated the suspect also hit him in the face and they both started fighting. In the report, the victim says other people started fighting him too and that the bus driver was notified, but the bus didn't immediately stop. To stay up at night, he doesn't go to sleep. The report states a mother of one of the suspects got on the bus and threatened to fight the victim as well. Authorities have not determined a motive for the incident. While in Boncourt today, the suspect's mother spoke out and said there's more to what happened. He didn't deserve this. He did not deserve this. The Myers family has consulted an attorney at this point. It's still unclear whether any other students involved in that bus fight will face charges. A school shooting and bomb attack.